pigeon target acquired. Ah, gotta get him. these names. Is Sandra happy to see them back? Well, uh, actually, she's not with us anymore. Can't, you know. Howard, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. Life for living, not moping. First thing she told me after the diagnosis. Gotta remind myself of that every now and again. Keep looking, will you? Finding the rest of these birds would really mean a lot. Thanks, Spider-Man. So, we installed energy-saving LED billboards all around this area. This station monitors how they're performing. I'm just hoping it saves enough money that Oscorp keeps this program going. Typical. Oscorp ignored the specs and jacked up the voltage going into the billboards. I need to use my electric webs to shock the screens into shutting down. And I don't have long to do it. Maybe someday there'll be a billboard of me. That doesn't say menace on it. I always knew someday they'd weaponize tackiness. Explosions would make these ads more interesting. should really bring back sign painting. Gotta hit each screen individually. threats passed, they can adjust the billboards properly. And they did save a lot of money, which seems to be Oscorp's priority, so I bet this station's in the clear. Okay, that's how I can get into Norman's office. Can't get in there without shutting down some security systems. But if they see me, they'll put the whole place on lockdown. I should be able to hack into the security network modules from the outside. There are the network cables. Just need to follow them to the security module. There we go, a security module. Looks like there's four of these around the building. That should make things easier. What the hell? Security teams, call in. 
Sable Team Alpha standing by. Looks like an electrical problem. Copy that. Keep an eye on the exterior while we try to track down the issue. Just when I thought it would be easy. Stable teams. Looks like we have some sort of software problem. We're calling in a specialist. Copy that. Continuing exterior sweep. There's the second module. What? All agents. Someone's taking control of one of our subsystems. Initiating Delta protocol. Man, everybody's got drones these days. Stable teams. I need a status report. Exterior sweep negative. We are all clear. Still look like a software issue? We don't know. We're evaluating. Please maintain current alert level. Attention all Sable teams. There's a small possibility we have a trespasser on site. We're analyzing data now. Stay vigilant. Copy that, Control. There it is. Damn it. Another subsystem is going offline. I need a team to scan the 85th floor exterior. Copy control, bird inbound. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just don't do anything crazy. Speaking of crazy, gotta find that last module. There's the last one. Nice. Now I can get into Norman's office and hopefully find out more about Morgan Michaels and Devil's Breath. Exterior sweep negative. Should we go on lockdown? Not yet. Mr. Osborne is in the middle of an important call, but keep tracking. There must be someone out there. Hold on. Switching to a secure line. I'm way ahead of you, Wilson. I had my people go through all your files. If you try to expose our business arrangement, it'll be your word against mine. And I'm not the one behind bars right now. Wait, is Norman talking to Wilson Fisk? The Neo statue. What are you talking about? The Neo statue from the auction house. They must be talking about that file MJ found. Jackpot. GR27. Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist, but the location of the lab is redacted. AI controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. Cystic fibrosis? Huntington's? This is crazy. Creepy. Whoa. GR-27 is Devil's Breath. It's designed to cure diseases, but in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find Devil's Breath. MJ, get this. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders. But its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michaels' location, it'll be Oscorp's CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards! How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound. That could go bad fast. I should head to Central Park.
attention units, we've got reports of muggings in the area. Any officers near Midtown North, please copy. Looks like Doc checked in. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Stage, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired, old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired sputterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. Hope he's not too excited. Not getting much coverage. I should look for more towers to activate. Attention units. Report received of a narcotics sale in progress. Incident was reported in Central Park. Where are you, MJ? trying to reach him very very quietly gotta go partner standish is somewhere in there gotta get past that guard time to see if these lures pete gave me work that gap in the fence looks promising just need to distract the guard Gonna check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. House guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. Need to draw him away from the stairs. What the? What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. Standish is secure, ma'am. Lockout comms as well. I do not want leaks to press about Michael's or Devil's Breath. On it. She's nervous. Standish must know something about Dr. Michael's. Continuing sweep. I won't distract him for long. How's it looking? Convoy gonna be ready? Five by five. As soon as boss gives the word, we'll get Michael's move to the new safe house. They're moving him. 
Have to find out where before we lose our shot. Get that truck moving. Should have been uptown half an hour ago. Copy. We're rolling. Truck's about to move. Should use it as cover. Go, go, go. units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. Looks important. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. Gotta move. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it. Hope his ego doesn't bite him in the ass. Or us. Again? What's up with these lights? Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Okay. He wants to kill me? He told him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. Watson. I've heard your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Oh, what that the was hell? not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. Well, that was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. <laughs> you knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I screwed up. It was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military. You know what? Can we not do this right now? Please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. 
Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Felicia's keeping busy. But I'm catching up. Man, I'm wor- Let's see where she hit this time. There you are. Cornelius Van Lunt's place. She's hitting places full of one-of-a-kind valuables. She must be working for someone. Otherwise, why not just steal cash? That's Miles' mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? Rio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the feast shelter. Glad to. And please call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Aunt May know, and I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us. Looks like the bomb guy's M.O. Only this time he's using a drone to seed spy cams around the city. I better round him up and take down that drone. There's the drone. Hand down. There's the drone. Yoink! Now I can catch the drone. Not gonna lie, 
feeling pretty good about myself right now. Not bad. You got skills. I got skills too. And I thought robocalls were obnoxious. Well, I shut down his spy cams. Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and uh, there were no cabs. But I'll be there as soon as I can. Thanks, creepy stalker guy. You can call me Taskmaster. Because you keep leaving me tasks? That's kind of on the nose. There's a group of mercenaries committing. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. The signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter.
I'd call that a mild success. I call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... It can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Ah, uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. I showed up with stains on my shirt, ten minutes late from stopping a mugging. Still can't believe Doc hired me. Hope he doesn't regret it now. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful... An intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch. Noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. <sighs> I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time. Hmm. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye.